close out this program, ladies and gentlemen, please a big round of applause to Diane Bitter. backtrack on that I missed before. Mike Silverwood. Where is Mike? Fabulous. Stand up, Mike. This is Mike. Your friend, Mike. <laughs> Mike is our Rockingham County Chair, and I neglected to acknowledge you earlier. I'm sorry, Mike. Excuse me. And also, I want to ask Verity Swain to just uh, tell us again, on this same subject of voter fraud, the, the national, uh, the, uh, the New Hampshire Republican women are sponsoring at their Lilac Luncheon. Come up and tell us the program. Yes, we are delighted to have Anita Moncrief, who is very good friends with, with James O'Keefe. And she works with him um, all over the country. And she is coming to be our keynote speaker. And she will also, and I really want to plug this, at 10 a.m. on May 21st, she is going to be presenting a workshop with lots and lots of good material. It's called Protecting the Ballot Box. And she will teach us how to work against voter fraud and to preserve election integrity. And I just encourage you, the Lilac Luncheon starts at 11.30, but 10 a.m. is the workshop. So um, look up the website, nhfrw.org, and um, it'll tell you about the Lilac Luncheon that will be coming up on May 21st. That's two weeks from tomorrow at the Crown Plaza in Nashua. Thank you. Thank you. You can find that on the website as well. just would like to make you all aware there's a public hearing on Senate Bill 289, the amendment that the House is putting on the Senate bill, uh, which is an amendment we wrote, and it will be this Tuesday at uh, 2 o'clock in the uh, Legislative Office Building, Room 308. If anybody would like to participate in the public hearing on this bill, because what we've done, the Senate sent us over a bill that was primarily aimed at collecting information for the future. That's good, except we have some concerns about the way that information is claimed. Uh, but we think we should institute photo ID in this, this fall's election. And that's going to be a very hard thing to occur because the clerks don't want to do it. The Secretary of State is reluctant because of the time involved and the training involved. And the Attorney General's office is reluctant. So, uh, the same Attorney General that you just heard about here. Uh, and so, if you would like to participate, you're welcome to come and uh, have some fun at, uh, at the public hearing. Thank you. Thanks, Will. Thank you so much, everyone. This has been a fabulous day. I thank you all for coming. But especially, I want to thank all of my committee who have made this day the most wonderful day. Thank you to all of you, hard workers, all the volunteers. My deep appreciation.